Okay, everyone, we are back with the interview with Seifer. This is part two of two. Okay, Seifer, we had some rumors floating around on Blood Rhyme. People were saying that Seifer was going out there trying to scalp the new players, trying to get the new Wells to join him and Invictus. Is there any truth to that? I was trying to, you know, uh, ally up with, with the Limpes in the beginning because I heard they were coming over to our server. Uh, even though I, I, I also heard that they were uh, coming to... Uh, to join three or III. Okay, so all right, so you were trying to recruit the Olympus. Now here's the thing: if it's so bad that three got the Olympus, what would be better with your Invictus getting the Olympic group? The Olympus, you know, if they would have chosen to 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 ally up with them, that that would be a competition towards three. Okay, so that makes it sounds a little bit different. So you were reaching out to the new whales in order to create some kind of balance of power against the whales that are already on the server. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't do anybody harm by just trying to ask if they would ally up with, you know, my clan Invictus. Okay, so I guess that does clear it up for some people, I hope. Drop a note down in the comments if you got something to say to Seifer or if you want additional information. At Seifer, at this point, let's give you the seat. What do you want to let us know? What do you want to tell people about your feelings uh, with LLL or III? With their current situation, the power that they have, it's going to be very possible for them if they choose to, if they want to, to remain, you know, to remain immortals for a very long time, to, you know, to hold the reign for a very long time. Um, you know, which, which, you know, that's, that's, that's for them to, to decide. Which, Which is, is a little, little bit unfortunate, unfortunate though. Well, fortunately, this last reign, as we just saw, the LLL group did voluntarily step down and let new groups come in to be immortals. All right, let's get back. Okay, I have a list of things that people were interested in. Rumor, Seifer, you were trying to make people's server transfer. What do you say about that one? They just wanted to switch to another server so that, you know, so that there would be more balance in the game. Because they felt, you know, they didn't, they, did, they just didn't like the fact that, that one clan rules the whole server. And that was what started people, you know, considering about transferring servers. Okay, so you're saying you had nothing to do with motivating people to move to other servers. And you, I mean, because from what I heard, your entire clan was supposed to move to another server uh me myself and even my clan we 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 had the top we had the thoughts of it of you know like hey let's transfer to another server you know maybe it will be more balanced it will be more fun still plenty of fun to be had here on blood rhyme uh but as a relief to you and the other people we just saw recently rosaline uh, split off from the limpe group who split off from fatal paladin all the whales have separate clans and they're recruiting people openly in world chat at times um what are your plans going forward on blood rhyme well, what are my plans well that's a good question because i'm just i'm just chilling to be honest you know yeah yeah nothing wrong with a little bit of chilling our server does seem to be one of the popular servers well, let me talk about the popularity i think this uh the blood rhyme server has a pretty good popularity although i wouldn't say it is the most busiest for example blood raven they have probably at least double or triple the amount of players that we have yeah well blood raven is a little bit of a different puppy because remember they had a lodia in the beginning one of the biggest streamers in the southeast asia region bringing people to her server okay okay i see i didn't know that ah that, that explains a lot oh my god it's a guy who professes to be from wakanda you didn't know elodia the the woman who interviewed the original staff of that wakanda movie well anyway um before we wrap this up what what would you like people to know what what do you want to say go ahead if people want to know or any proof about the truth they can always you know send me a message i have you know plenty of screenshots and stuff but again there's no need to prove myself of you know accusations that were not truth uh at the in the first place most of the things that i wanted to say i already said and i meant no harm or you know any you know any bad things about anybody or anyone just want everybody in this in this whole server to have fun respect each other uh but you know there are always toxic players that hope that everybody in our server not to just you know blatantly to to believe in any of those you know things without you know doing a little research for themselves or you know talk to the person 
to find out the truth. That's it. That's it. I'm not going to say anything more. Okay, once again, thanks for shedding some light on your side of the story there, Seifer. People, I want you to go ahead and take this time to hit subscribe down there. We're going to be bringing you more goodies in the future. Wrapping it up, interview with Seifer, part two of two.